I'm Josh George. This is Week 5 College Football. We're going to start with the Thursday game. We have North Carolina and Miami. I think it's going to be a really good Thursday night game, but I'm picking turnover chain. Miami beats North Carolina. Then, two Friday games where both teams are ranked. We're going to start with BYU and Washington. BYU's looked really good on defense, but... Jake Browning, I think he's a little bit better and can find the holes in the defense. And Washington beats BYU. The other Friday game, Oregon at Cal Berkeley. Oregon, for the first three quarters of the game, looked like they were better than Stanford. I think Oregon's better than Cal Berkeley. And Justin Herbert, I think he emerges as a Heisman candidate. If he can lead his Ducks to victory, I think he will. Oregon beats beats Cal Berkeley. Then, to the Saturday slate, Q's and Clemson. I think it's going to be closer than a lot of people think. I think the reason for that is the quarterback at Syracuse, Eric Dugby. And if, if uh, Syracuse wins, it's because of him. But the FPI gives Clemson a 92% chance to win. I'm not picking against those odds. Clemson beats Syracuse. Then on to a Big 12 game. West Virginia hosts Texas Tech in what I think could be a phenomenal game. Cliff Kingsbury finally has his quarterback uh, Bowman playing really well, but Will Greer is playing a little bit better. This is the best team that Texas Tech has played, and if they, sh I want them to show me more before I'll pick them in a big game like this. So I'm picking West Virginia to beat Texas Tech. Then Florida at Mississippi State. I think this could be a really good game. Both teams have lost to Kentucky. That's the comparable game. Florida looked a little bit better. Franks has played a little bit better at quarterback than Prince Gerald, but it is a home game for Mississippi State. The West has l has been the better conference than the, uh, the better division than the East, so I'm going to pick Mississippi State and the Cowbells to beat Florida. Then the next game on the slate of games is, of course, South Carolina at Kentucky. Kentucky, they've got to stay physical. They've got to play good in the run game. I like what Mark Stoops has done so far. They haven't given me any reason to pick against them yet. So Kentucky will beat South Carolina. Mark Stoops beats Will Muschamp. Then we continue on the slate of games going to UVA, NC State. UVA is a really hot team. They beat... Louisville 27 to 3 and that could really springboard their season I think but NC State has they're undefeated that they've just looked better all around so North Carolina State beats Virginia then Stanford and Notre Dame I think this could be a really good game KJ Collins has looked really good leading this offense especially with Bryce Love in the backfield but Ian Brook came on for Notre Dame in that Wake Forest game. Notre Dame's playing at home. Stanford could have lost. I think this is a game that Stanford's going to need to play really strong fundamentally and have a big fourth quarter. And I don't know if they can do it two weeks in a row. So I'm going to pick Notre Dame to beat Stanford. Then to the game of the week. Ohio State at Penn State, wideout conditions. Dwayne Haskins against Trace McSorley. Great quarterback battle, big offenses, and when you watch these defenses, when you looked at Ohio State against TCU and Oregon State, Ohio State's defense looked vulnerable. Penn State's defense looked vulnerable against Appalachian State, and so I think it's going to be a high-scoring game. I think you're going to have to score 40, 45 points in order to win. Frankly, I flipped a coin. It came up tails. 
Nittly Lions have tails, so Penn State beats Ohio State. Then to the game you're going to want to watch. Baylor at OU. I think it could be a really close game, closer than people think, because Mike Stoops' defense, not that great. But OU finds a way to beat Baylor in a game that you're going to want to watch because it's going to be closer than you think. Then the upset pick of the week. I'm picking Vatek to upset Duke. Vatek got upset last week. They're going to want to bring it this week. And I think they can do it and pull the upset against Duke. I'm Josh George. This is Week 5 College Football.